Hi all, this is Journal of Traits with a, another review. Uh, today I'm reviewing my new Kenwood fridge freezer. It is a Kenwood 60-40 uh, split um, and the measurements as advertised are 188.5 centimetre height, 59.9, sorry, 59.5 centimetre width and a 69 centimetre depth. I did find that the depth um, differed slightly from what was advertised. Um, I actually found when I measured it, it was 62 centimetres. So for those of you that are wondering whether or not it will fit into your space at home, uh, 62 centimetres is what I have measured. There is a gap at the back as well, just to make sure that there's enough airflow around the appliance. So 62 centimetres is what I measured. Um, as you can see from the external, uh, there is a non-plumbing water dispenser, which is always useful. Um, the uh, unit where you put the water into um, is actually detachable, which I think is great because you can take it out and wash it. Um, but I would only advise putting water in there. Um, I will go ahead and open the fridge. And this is the general layout, which is not dissimilar to your average fridge freezer, but you can see it is very, very spacious. There is a large drawer um, at the bottom, and then you have four shelves or three shelves, if you want to look at it that way, uh, to store the rest of your bits and pieces. And then if you have a look at the inside of the door, you have a top shelf, which is very large. Uh, and then you have another shelf in the middle and another shelf at the bottom and all three are fantastic sizes. You also might have noticed that there's a water tank also. This holds up to three litres of water which I think is brilliant and you just simply fill it up through there. Back into the main part of the fridge now and you'll notice that uh, you can control the temperature using the uh, temperature gauge and you can do that really easily by pressing either either end of the buttons depending on whether you want to change the temperature in the fridge or the freezer um, so that's fairly easy I mean the manual goes into all of the great details um, so it's fairly easy to use so this is the main fridge what I also like about this as well is that you have really nice solid handles. Um, they're not flimsy at all. They're really, really sturdy and it can withstand, you know, the amount of times that you or your family would go in and out of the fridge. And then down here is the freezer and you have three substantial drawers. The advertised litre space is 89 but my previous fridge was 97 and I managed to get all my things in here and there is still space. The top drawer is uh, a medium size, the middle drawer is quite large actually, it's very very deep. So you can see that I still have quite a bit of space in there and if you look at it from the side it's very very substantial and then the drawer at the bottom is just again another medium sized drawer but again there's loads and loads of space so overall I would say excellent buy I purchased this from Curry's I believe that Curry's seem to have some sort of exclusivity with Kenwood um, I couldn't find it anywhere else but I mean Curry's were good enough they delivered on time uh, when they said they would. So again, if you are contemplating buying the Kenwood, um, I would recommend it. I've had products from them before and I can't fault them to be honest. They've always been reliable. Um, so I can't, I, I, you know, I don't have anything bad to say about the brand at all. Um, and for those of you that want to know the actual model number, this is a Kenwood KN F60 X17 6040 fridge. There are quite a few that look similar to this one. Um, 
but this I believe is the only one in the range that is doing curries with the water dispenser at this price point but there's so many others um, it might be worth you going into store as well to have a look like I did but just thought I'd do this review for any anybody that was wondering or you know wanted further information okay